Hi, Jason Knott with CE Pro, and today we are talking about luxury motorized residential shading. And we know that the shading category has become a staple for so many integrators, and they can thank Lutron for that because Lutron was the first one to bring motorized shading to the custom installation industry over a decade ago. And they've continued to innovate in the category. And to talk with me today about some of those innovations and some of those trends in the category is Margaret Block, uh, Lutron's product manager for luxury residential shades. Hi, Margaret. Hi, Jason. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Thanks for joining me today. Okay, so let's jump right into it. How can motorized window treatments be a great intersection point for integrators to work closely with interior designers on their projects? Well, motorized shades, first of all, are such an exciting category right now. There's such a design element to it. And I think everyone would agree that the way that daylight comes into a room absolutely changes the look and feel of that space, right? And so I think integrators that are really effective at working with interior designers, they do a couple things. They have quick access to the materials and resources that interior architects and designers need. So those could be specification resources, drawings, um, being able to quickly find materials and sampling, right, to give to those designers when they need it. Um, they also know how to really simply explain how the system works in really simple language so that a designer understands, you know, how, how what they're offering is different than maybe a traditional approach. Um, another great thing that I've seen is integrators that are really able to articulate the functional benefits of a fabric. So being able to say, you know, this 3% fabric versus a 10% fabric is going to do this to the light coming in through a space or, you know, a light colored fabric versus a dark colored fabric for optimizing uh, uh, views, right? And then lastly, I think when integrators are working with interior designers, it's really just about empowering them to execute on their client's vision, right? It's not about necessarily specifying the solution or specifying the fabric, but helping them understand what options are available so that they can curate that for their customers. What do you typically hear from integrators? Are they uh, letting the designers work with the homeowner on the, the fabric selection and colors? Um, or does the integrator kind of insert himself into that process? or? Is it really that collaborative process? It's pretty collaborative. I mean, I've, I've seen a lot of both, but I think it, it tends to work most harmoniously when you really let the designer kind of be in the driver's seat, really talk about how those fabrics and those styles um, work well together with the whole interior vision of the home, but then letting the integrator really talk about how the function of the shade or of that style can lend itself to insulation or view or privacy. Um, that seems to go over really well. Fantastic. All right. So I mentioned Lutron was an innovator, the, 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 the leader of this category, and we're coming off the heels of Cedia Expo. Tell us about some of the latest innovations product offerings or program support offerings from Lutron? Sure, we, we continue to make heavy, heavy investments in this category at Lutron. Um, it's a big category of growth for us and for the industry. Um, and so this year we've shown a lot of great things at Cedia. Um, first and foremost is the palladium wire free shade. So this is something that we introduced um, early this year. Um, and it's essentially, you know, it's kind of coming off the heels of our 2017 launch of palladium wired shades, which was that really premium aesthetic intended to be seen, not hidden in a pocket or covered with a fascia. And palladium wire free just adds infinitely more flexibility to that solution by removing the need for power wiring, right? So it's powered by batteries. You still get that really streamlined aesthetic, tons of hardware finishes, hem bar finishes and options. Um, and the solution still gets you that three to five year battery life, which is kind of that non-negotiable feature that people have come to expect from Lutron battery shades. Um, one of the other things that we're showing uh, at Cedia this year is our triathlon wood blind, which is a tilt only wood blind that has this really cool feature called natural light optimization that works now with Homeworks with QSX processors, as well as Radio Raw 3. Um, and what that does is the system actually helps identify what direction the window is that that, sh that that blind is in and knows what the position of the sun is at any time during the day. And so it allows you to optimize when those blinds could be open 
to, to bring in that daylight when it's available and when it can, when the tilts can actually prevent some daylight from coming in if there's too much glare or too much heat, or, you know, it could potentially fade furnishings or your floor. So it's really a really intelligent feature that um, we're pretty excited about in that space. Uh, and then the third thing that we showed at Cedia is a new architectural honeycomb shade. So this is a totally redesigned headrail system that prevents some light leakage at the top of the shade. Um, it supports three quarter inch cell sizes for, uh, you know, an elevated aesthetic, improved insulation. We have a lot of new colors and textures in the honeycomb fabric panel space. Um, it's a really, really nice new solution for us. Well, wow, lots of great uh, options there in the intelligence for that, that wood uh, blind intelligence sounds fascinating. Uh, all right, so what are some of the key trends in motorized window treatments that integrators can use to help increase their sales opportunities? Yeah, so like I said, we're seeing so much growth in this space and I think it's stemming you know, both from increased awareness just in smart home and technology in general, but also more and more demand for you know, comfort and well-being in the home, right? They're looking for solutions that technology can bring to promote that. And, you know, when we think of well-being, that could mean uh, feelings of privacy and security in your space, right? So automated shades are, are wonderful at doing that. If they're on a schedule and, you know, after sunset, a privacy shade will come down to um, close the windows in your living room or bedroom or so be it, just kind of to create that feeling of comfort. You know, well-being can also mean access to daylight during the day. And we know, you know, in these in these beautiful, huge homes that our integrators are in, you'll have 30, 40 shades that that all need to move at the same time. And when those are manual, they tend to not move, right? So you're not really taking advantage of the daylight that um, many of these homeowners are actually paying for, those beautiful views. So we wanna make sure that we can promote that, that feeling of well-being and that, that functionality of that, of that product. Um, I think also our customers, you know, they value choice, they value options. Um, they like to know that motorized shades means more than just a roller shade moving up and down. It means that they could have automated drapery track systems. They could have honeycomb shades, horizontal shear blinds, even skylight systems with hundreds of different fabric options um, that can really coordinate with whatever design trend or design theme that they're going for in their home. Um, that, that's very important. And so when we think about that from an engineering development standpoint, we think about how do we make sure we can give homeowners and integrators those options no matter when shades are added to a project, right? Like we all say, the earlier you can get into a project, the better, right? When the walls are open, you can pull a wire. Um, when, you're, when you're designing you know, the architectural plans, you can design in a pocket or recess and all that's great. But a lot of the times with, with shades and automated shades, they're thought of kind of at the very end. And so we wanna make sure that if that happens, the homeowner is not stuck with limited options because they're they're limited to a wire-free or battery solution. So we're always thinking about that, you know, on our end. Uh, yeah, lots of lots going on certainly in the category, uh, and some of the amazing installations that I've seen done with uh, Lutron shades. It's really, as you said, only limited by the imagination of the the integrator and you know, working with the homeowner and the designer, some amazing uh, shaped windows and, and configuration. Oh, yeah. So so one of the things about shading that's kind of difficult is it's such a visual thing and many integrators don't have uh, showrooms uh, to be able to showcase this. What's, what's some of the ways that they can use such as the Lutron Experience Centers to be able to showcase some of the options that you just discussed? Yeah, that is, that is so true. You know, the, the products, I mean, not just our products, so many of the products that our integrators are offering, they need to be experienced in person, right? And that's why we invest so much in experience centers all over the world. You know, we have um, multiple experience centers in New York, uh, London, Toronto. We have um, a new one opening in Los Angeles. And it's really to do just that. You know, you have to feel in the space what it means when the light changes, when 30, 40, 50 shades move silently and in perfect alignment at the same time, right? That's that's magical. And, you know, we find that a lot of integrators and designers use our spaces uh, for fabric specification, right? To be able to uh, feel and see a 3% 
um, sheer fabric and a light color and a dark color and see how light filters through that piece of material before they um, you know, elect to use that fabric across their entire home. So it's a critical kind of hands-on experience that we feel is absolutely mandatory when, when you're talking about solutions like this. And those experience centers, uh, appointment only, um, is that how they get access to them? Uh, typically, typically we have um, either designers work with their integrators, they can schedule appointments with our showroom managers, um, and a couple of our centers also uh, accommodate walk-ins. Fantastic. Okay, so you mentioned this um, trend of being able to make sure you, that, that shades help bring in the, the natural light, but also, you know, Lutron is heavily involved in artificial light, especially with its Ketra brand. Can you talk about how integrators can package this control of natural light and creation of artificial light together for their customers? Yeah, I like to uh, think about this really from the standpoint of the design of the home. So if you think about lighting fixtures and automated shades, I mean, they are inextricably part of the architecture of a home, right? And so when we think about that, architects, they're always looking for ways to kind of dissolve the boundary between the indoors and the outdoors, right? And when we combine automated shades with a fully tunable lighting system like Ketra, right? We can finally offer that solution that we've been working towards for the last half a century, right? Which is being able to create that sanctuary in the home with beautiful light, but also that connection to the outdoors, no matter you know, what the moment calls for. And you know, when we think about this at Lutron, we think about how curating the best light requires access to the best light sources, right? So Ketra's portfolio of intelligent light, and then with automated shades, I mean, the sun is arguably the, the most dynamic and powerful light source in the world. What's amazing is how the new lighting fixtures can really, as you say, mirror the natural light outside because we, we thought that we were doing that for so many years with incandescence, but the, the, the functionality and the capability of LEDs, when you can see the difference in a demo, it's mind blowing. It is, and I've been in uh, so many homes where they've used both automated shades and Ketra, for example, and it's amazing how much Ketra can extend that daylight into the space. It feels as if the daylight from the windows is actually reaching further into the space than it actually is. It's incredible. Yeah. So uh, last point, if an integrator wants to find out more about Lutron motorized shades, what should they do? So I would first uh, start with luxury.lutron.com. That's our um, kind of our, our website where we're promoting all of this information. We have lots of beautiful imagery to kind of help paint that picture for designers or for clients. Um, and then reach out to your Lutron salesperson or rep to kind of get access to an experience center to really start learning about this and showing this off. Okay, lots of great information. Margaret Block, thanks for joining CEO Pro today. Thanks, Jason.